Charles Feindall. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Oh, that was a restful sleep. Oh, good morning, Omar. Wait, what's that? You say there's a commotion? Up at the sleeping giant. What? Helgen has gone dark. Nobody's heard from anybody in days. Come, come on, let, let's go see. Let me just pray and then let, we'll, we'll get on up there. Julianos, I'm going to need your guidance and your wisdom. Thank you. All right, come on, let's go. All right, we'll be back. We'll be back. Wait, are you small again? Oh, no, this is Blade. Okay, but you are small. See, I'm getting y'all confused because you both have your hair braided. Anyway, let's go. Oh, man, it was raining yesterday morning, and it's still raining now. Just what I need. Nobody even out here. Let's check in the inn. Just to make sure you you heard right. Everybody's huddled up in here. Is there anybody? Are these like refugees or something? Hello, Delphine. I understand that uh, Helgen has gone dark. Alright, I'm gonna go up there now and investigate. Come on, let's go. So it is true. It would be a terrible rainy day. Fortunately, Helgen isn't that far, so I can get some exercise. Shod. And all this running is making me a little peckish. I'll Ain't try this to make this quick. All right, let's go. that well thank you oh ma Still gotta open this.
Oh no, you don't. Wait. That's it. Oh no, did I, I beat him into the ground? That's too bad. I really wanted to... Wait, wait. Here we go. Yes. Nice. seen such a thing. Mm. He didn't even hear me coming. Is someone there? Head on to Helgen. Hopefully, nobody will see me. Now, what are these wolves gonna do? Oh, okay. Now, y now y'all know how to act. It's a shame when I'm in human form they want to attack me. Uh oh. Oh no, that was feigned all. Oh my. Oh no. Oh, what have I done? Let's go. Somebody'll just think it was a wild beast. He was out hunting. Where is um Helgen? Oh, here we go. another meal for me. Well, I might 
as well. Strengthen myself. Go ahead and take the speed. I don't know, I've had issues with swap. Let's see. Leap attacks. There's something up here, but I don't know. Is this Helgen? No, I think that's Helgen over there. What's this over here? Dragon, another one. Uh oh, I'm about to change back. It's probably for the better. I don't know what we're gonna find inside here. This is Helgen. It's it's been totally destroyed. journal here. All right, hard to believe I filled up that whole journal already. I never realized how much Cyrodiil I hadn't seen yet. So much diversity, yet so much destruction from the Great War. A lot of history has been lost here forever. The expedition is ending soon and everyone will be returning home. I have one last task to perform before I do the same. I'll send the other journal ahead with my supplies and the artifacts we recovered. I've received word from my contacts in Skyrim. All seem quiet for now, probably the first time since High King Toreg was killed. I should be able to make the crossing quietly enough during the night so long as there are no Imperial patrols to deal with. So much for being discreet. 
I crossed the border near a small village called Helgen and made my way up to Darkwater Crossing. Unfortunately, I can't get back to my camp now because the area has filled with Imperial patrols. It seems they are searching for someone, someone very important, if I'm not mistaken, someone they intend to ambush here. This could be the very thing I'm seeking here in Skyrim, but crossing the border in the dead of night without passing through the checkpoints has turned out to be a very bad plan. I woke early this morning with an Imperial sword pressed to my neck. A patrol found me camped under a rock outcropping on the edge of the volcanic marshes. I guess I wasn't as well hidden as I thought. I have no idea where they're taking us, but I've been stuffed into the back of a rickety old cart being pulled by an even more rickety looking old nag. At least they let me keep my journal. For now. Shores, bones, if only I had known sooner. The ambush, the captives in the car with me, Stormcloak rebels, led by none other than Ulfric Stormcloak himself. There's no time to explain properly. I scarcely believe it myself. If I had, if it hadn't been for the dragon, the dragon, I, I'd not even be here to write this down. Yes, a dragon, big black, as large as the towers of the keep itself. It swooped in and out of nowhere and laid waste to the village and the keep. General Tullius didn't take my head today or the heads of several Stormcloak rebels, but that doesn't matter now. Hadvar and Raylof set aside their differences to help the survivors. They went into the lower keep hours ago. Something about the caves with a back entrance, I don't think they're coming back. I'll have to see if I can get out of the city and down to Riverwood. Someone needs to warn them. This building won't remain standing for much longer. I can't believe it. A dragon straight out of the legends. Nobody back home will ever believe me. Hmm. This is terrible. It's all true. Alright, let me see something here. Has two choices. Oh, okay. Oh, when my beast power comes back, it catches me off guard. Anything in here of value? It's an imperial helmet. is down here and I'm getting hungry again wait a minute do I have this um armor I think I did try put this on display yeah I'm not gonna worry about it 
I think I need Stormcloak officer armor though. Come on. I still can't get over Feindall. It's like I, I just didn't recognize him. It was too late. Hood. Healing. It's a lot of uh, books in here. Dragonborn, I better take this. As our efforts are stalled with the Dragonborn Gallery because there's no Dragonborn. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna have to eat these people. It's just too tempting. Skeleton. Mm, those bones were tasty. some more bodies at the entrance. See if there's anybody else down here.
think we're we're done here. All right, so somewhere there's a cave. I got to keep my hood this time. There is something magical about werewolf transformations. Alright, what are we looking for here? Alright, there's somebody here. A Nord. Wearing imperial armor and a storm cloak. I don't know. Who do we choose? Let me see if I can help him. What do you mean, what am I doing back here? I came to see what was going on. What do you mean, am I crazy? Riverwood will burn. I need to go warn them now. What are you talking about? I don't think you understand. What do you mean, am I daft? Oh, never mind. Let me just help help out here. All right. I do have a healing potion. Well, I thought I did. Yes, here. Let me give you the grand drought of health. What? That didn't work? Well, okay, there we go. Alright, let's go. I was used to fancy lights and effects. Wait. The other body is gone. That was... Now you saw the other body. I hope I made the right choice. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. What? Better clear out of here. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. I know Gerder. It's probably best if we split up. All right. I have I a home in Riverwood. You've today. been you've been gone for a while. I'm the new alchemist. Well, the old alchemist by now, because I've been living there for over a year now. You know, you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. Hmm. Well, I think I did right make the right decision because I was attacked by the Thalmor. And I know the Imperials and the Thalmor work together. See that ruin up there? Bleak well, Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could yeah. stand living in the shadow of that place. I've, I've been up I there. I guess you get used to it. I've been up there to get the Golden Claw. Uh oh. Oh, it's. It's Feindall. He's been attacked by a wild animal. Alright, 
Rest in peace, Fane doll. I'm so sorry. Julianos, watch over him. All right, let's go. Oh, thank you for waiting. We'll have to have somebody come and get his body. I'm sure you knew Fandall if you live in Riverwood. These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead. See for yourself. Um, I already have, uh, interacted with these stones and found plenty more. Right now I'm under the influence of the Serpent Stone and I'm hoping the Lover Stone, but I'm not sure. Because, well, this crown of Ethereum, it has some strange, uh, behavior all right well you can stand there I'm not choosing a, a stone come on he's gonna stay back there isn't he you think I oh no here he comes I'm glad choosing a stone, not choosing one, is an option. Yes. Come on. A dragon! I saw a dragon! What? What is it now, Mother? She's right. It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It, it flew right over the barrel. Yes, it came Dragons from Elgin. now, is it? Please, Mother. If you keep on like this, everyone in town will think you're crazy. She's not crazy. And I've got better things to do than listen to more of Looks your like nobody here knows Sven. you're in nothing but trouble. Come on. I know, I know, I have made things difficult for you, Sven. But I did see the dragon in Helgen, your mother's right. Truly? Yes. So maybe my mother isn't crazy after all. No, she's not. You'd best tell the Jarl in Whiterun. He needs to know about this. Oh, okay, I will. I'm glad we're speaking What are you wasting my time for? It was oh. a dragon. It'll kill us all and then you'll believe me. Well, hopefully it won't Good come to, to that. You. you too. Until next time. All right, you take care. Who do I need to talk to? Gerda. Where's Gerda? Gerda, I'm fine. At least now I am. Are you hurt? What's happened? And who is this? One of your comrades? Gerda, you know me. Not the comrade yet, but the friend. I owe him my life, in fact. I, mean, I might be a little underdressed right now, There's but I'm sure you recognize me. Helgen, will reach the Imperials. Helgen? Has something happened? Yes, they You're went right. dark. Follow me. Pod, come here a minute. I need your help with something. What is it, woman? Spend drunk on the job again? Pod, just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha, I'll be right down. Do you really know Ulfric Stormcloak? Hush, Frodnar. This is no time for your games. 
Go and watch the south road. Come find us if you see any Imperial soldiers coming. Oh, Mama. I want to stay and talk with Uncle Rayla. Look at you. Almost a grown man. Won't be long before you'll be joining the fight yourself. That's right. Don't worry, Uncle Rayloff. I won't let those soldiers sneak up on you. Now, Rayloff, what's going on? You two look pretty well done in. <sighs> I can't remember when I last slept. Whew, where to start? Well, the news you heard about Alfric was true. The Imperials ambushed us outside Darkwater Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was... Uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. Had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards! They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. Treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. You don't mean a real, live... I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. And Helgen's Good. gone dark. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need to. Let me worry about the Imperials. Gerda, I Any live right across the river. Is a friend of mine. You know who I am. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. Gerda, I've been living here for over a year and you act like you don't know who I am. Really? There is something you could do for me. Oh. For all of us here. Okay. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Thanks. Well, it's, it's no problem I since I'm a, on you. a resident of Riverwood. I ought Riverwood. to get back to work before I missed, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric? Don't worry. I'm sure he made it out. It'll take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric's Stormcloak. I'll let them into the house and... You know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Help him. Good luck, I've brother. got my own I'll house. See you later. Don't worry about me. Oh, I know that's how a nice to trick. All right. You take care of yourself, Rayloff. I Ray told Lof. you my sister would help us out. So you're saying the dragon was on your side? What? Oh, hardly. I don't think even Ulfric could pull a dragon out of his pocket. Lucky for us it attacked when it did, eh? I wasn't looking forward to getting a shave from the Imperial Headsman. Well, I, I wouldn't know. I wasn't there. But anyhow, I'm glad you're safe. Good luck. I'm right across the bridge if you ever need me. I'm going to rest up here a while before heading to Windhelm. Be careful. Thank you. Alrighty. Let me get some clothes and then I think it's time for us to head to White Run and talk to the Yarl.